What is the difference between a slow speed shredder and a high speed grinder? A lot of it comes down to what material you want to put in and what material you want to get out. For a slow speed shredder, they are very very diverse in the range of materials that can be put into them. Anything from CND waste, uh, municipal waste, through to green waste. Depending on what shaft system you have in them is how well they perform for their throughput. The beauty of these machines is, is you can go to a tip site um, and get up to 40% reduction in your volumes. So what that means is anything can go into them within that municipal site um, because the machine looks after itself. If a big piece of eye beam went in there as an example, the machine will sense that in its load and then back off. It will try to put that through up to three times, if not it backs off for the removal of the product. The material that comes out of a slow speed is not what you'd call a specced product. Um, the variance between the sizing varies a bit more than what you'll get through a high speed. So the high speeds, the material that you put into these is predominantly a clean product. Um, and when I say clean, um, if you're doing a grinding or a hog fill pro process, the ability to put through dirt covered stumps as an example is not a problem whatsoever um, but anything like tramp metal is a no-go zone for these machines. The material that comes out of the high speeds um, at a higher production rate and you can spec that product with your screens to a lot finer tuning. Hope this clears it up and if there's any more questions please ring the team at Equip2.